The young di Putuan Agong Tuan Tu Mizanzano are bidden today issue the reminder to members of parliament to behave and to show excellent conduct while debating in parliament. In his royal address to the parliament on opening the second session of the 12th parliament, the king further reminded MPs to always abide and respect the rules in the August House. Better amat sedih dengan perilaku yang tidak sepatutnya di kalangan ahli-ahli yang berhormat pada sesi yang lalu yang memberi imej negatif kepada ahli-ahli yang berhormat dan dewan ini khususnya serta negara amnya. Parliament sessions after the March 8th general elections had seen several episodes of MPs uttering sexist and indecent remarks against women and unparliamentary words to an uproar after that. Meanwhile, the king also cautioned the people to be more careful and wise in evaluating news that is spread around today, especially on the blogs. He also expressed disappointment that narrow racist issues are still being brought up and debated in the countries despite after 51 years of independence. The king added that he will not hesitate to take action against any party that tries to divide the people to ensure peace and harmony is maintained. On the economy, the king advised companies to put priority on hiring locals instead of foreigners and also told the people to be less choosy about jobs in these tough economic conditions. Several MPs interviewed by the HTV today said the king's address is timely and welcomed his advice. Tuanku Baginda memberi amaran kepada ahli-ahli parlimen uh, supaya uh, ber, bertutur dan berhujah secara bersopan secara uh, untuk mem, men, uh, menjaga image parlimen dan juga institusi demokrasi ini sangat tepat sekali uh, saya, saya juga mengalu-alukan uh, uh, Tita Baginda dalam uh, mem, mengkritik tegur, tegur pihak-pihak uh, tertentu yang memainkan isu agama dan uh, perkauman untuk mendapatkan faedah politik uh, dan, uh, dan dengan itu mencetuskan kestabil, ketidakstabilan dan mengancam keharmonian masyarakat itu sangat tepat dan uh, ini kita harap uh, apa yang diucapkan ini diingati oleh uh, semua parti dan uh, sedikit sebanyak kita rasa agak malu uh, kerana apabila anak sekolah ini datang melawat uh, persidangan di Dewan Yang Mulia ini dan lihat gelagat ahli-ahli Dewan yang sebegitu rupa mau tak mau kita pun uh, rasa agak malu ya, dan uh, saya harap itu tidak akan berlaku dalam sesi akan datang ini It was a good speech uh, he, I think he, it is important that he spend a good portion of the speech on the issue of the economy because really the issue of the economy will be the most important issue for all of us for the next uh, one or two years in fact. My concern is that the government of the day, i.e. VN, is still in to a large extent in a state of denial and uh, that is what we need to address. The King's Royal Address comes in as a timely reminder to all Malaysians today, fresh after the Perak fiasco and as the world economy faces a severe recession. Ending his address, the King told political parties referring to Barisan National and Pakatan Rakyat to put their differences aside as the country needed to unite to face the global recession. Daniel Koo and Sakina Abdul Latif reporting for the HTV.